Yes, Sooth. Yes, brother. What are you saying? I'm blessed, brother. What, what are you doing? saying, people? Got all this munch. We've got a special, we've got a special edition of Sue's Sofa today. Since there's no guests, and it's just me and AJ, and we're trying loads of munches. All American brand. We've got some motherfucking birthday cake popcorn. Some of them you will recognise. Got a Twinkie. Oh, gee, is it one Twinkie in there or two in there? In there? I think there's two in a pack. I've got some twisted flaming hot cheese. He's asking that because he knows these motherfuckers are his favourite. Yeah. <laughs> got a butter finger, which I think is peanut butter. Yeah. Wild Wild West beef jerky. Ooh. Got some, uh, what are they? Cookies, cookies and, and cream. Cookies and cream Hershey's. Which I've tried that before, it's nice. Some dark chocolate Hershey's. Some more fucking Pop Tarts. Some, uh, I've not seen these before. Cheetos. Cheesy Cheetos. Cheesy Cheetos. Reese's Pieces. Oh. Some Nerds. Oh. We've got some S'mores. Which I've never tried before. No, I mean, either. It's a, an American thing, isn't it? We'll have to uh, whack the grill on for them and get the fucking toaster ready for the Pop Tarts. We'll just build a campfire in your living room. Yeah, well, we'll build everything else in my living room. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I just, just said to AJ, I need to get my fucking appetite going. To be fair, I smoke and lose my appetite anyway, but it was just a good excuse to blaze up. Needs his fix. <laughs> Alright. So then. So we've arranged it, so we're going to start with the... Savoury stuff first. The most savoury, which looks like the beef jerky. I don't know if this is a traditional... American star beef jerky, it's just the only shit that they had in Asda. But, but I'm not gonna lie, although Honey the barbecue. idea of beef jerky don't really appeal to me because it's chewy and I don't like chewy rubbery textures in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Dildos, but, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't know. But the thought of honey barbecue sounds quite nice. So hopefully the flavour will compensate for the shit texture, mm -hmm. is what I'm hoping. So I've never tried it before. I And then we've got some Cheetos. Mm. Can't go wrong with the Cheetos. I'm sure many of you have eaten Cheetos before. You can get them in most uh, corner shops nowadays in this country. And it can't you? <coughs> and these as well. Oh, I'm looking forward to them. Yeah, if anyone's watching and there's something on the table that we need to try, let us know and we'll get it and we'll... And as long as it ain't got gelatine in it, I'll give it a go. Yeah. Which I'm actually really shocked. Because uh, Aaron picks most of the stuff up and he don't think about things like that, like ingredients. I don't eat pork or anything with pork in it. So uh, the only one product that he picked up that actually had gelatine in it was snowballs. Where are the snowballs? Up on top of the microwave. I'll be trying one of them bad boys. Retrieve the snowball. Hostess, I think, yeah, hostess are the same people that make the uh, Twinkies. So complete. But yet yeah, these. But these are fucking... See, I don't understand that. Why would they put beef gelatine in this? I don't know. But pork, pork gelatine in this. But they're from the same family. Right, oh, should we get cracking yeah, man, let's try some of this Yeah, let's get jerky. some of this beef jerky sorted then. Wild, wild, wild west beef, honey barbecue, beef jerky. Oh yeah, right, let's have a go at this, all right. <laughs> I'm really dreading this. I let's, mean, have I can't, let's have a look at it. I can't eat mushrooms or anything like that because of the rubbery texture, and I know this is going to be rubbery as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> fuck me. That fucking stinks. <laughs> right, so if only you could smell it. Let's have a look at the stuff. Get one out. Let's have a look it at it. It smells like a bit. It smells spicy, you know, and it shouldn't even be spicy. Oh my god, look at that. That looks like shit. That does look like shit. So, um, I really don't want to clip my mouth, bruv. It's a popular delicacy in America, mate. I you know, want a bash? Oh. Oh, I mate. tried one the other day, go and have a bash. Yeah, and you told me it was awful. But then Saying that, but everyone else that tried it with him on that day yeah. said it was nice. Marge liked it, Wither liked it. But it smells like shit. Should I just go all in one go? Go on. I might have to spill it out though, man. Do you want to get something to spit it in? So just I will just bomb it in the ashtray. Bomb it in the ashtray. <laughs> no, bin's there. my joint's there, yeah. Bin's there. Ready. For the cans. <laughs> I 
What's the verdict? It's got tough, it's a fucking steak when it's cooked too long. <laughs> and it tastes really peppery. Considering that it says honey barbecue, it don't really... <laughs> well, I can't boil it. Spit it out then, bro. <laughs> Spit it out, bro. I need to fucking rinse my mouth out with some fucking <laughs> fluids, man. <laughs> so the beef jerky's a no. What would you what would you what would you give the beef jerky out? I don't know. Fucking zero. Zero. Yeah. Not, not even a one. Not, not even a one. Yeah. Like, it would have got a one if it actually tasted like honey and barbecue, but all I could taste was like fucking pepper. Literally, it just tasted like a fucking overcooked steak. Let's yeah. move on. No, nah, mate. The Cheetos will that. make it better. I'm not on that. So, so like people. Fuck yeah, the Wild West fucking beef I'm jerky. I'm sorry to any beef jerky lovers. But I can't act that, mate. Like, you guys have got some fucking mad taste buds and fucking... Maybe we'll have to get a different right. type of beef jerky next time and see. Because that... Maybe we'll have to get one that's just a little bit softer. Because fuck me, that was like chewing a brick of wood. Brick of wood? Plank of wood. What are those like, uh, they're like pepperonis, but... Pepperonis even, uh, a bit like a stick, but if it's beef jerky, do you know Yeah, what you I mean? get them in sticks, it's like close <coughs> of it, isn't it? I think we'll have to get some of that shit. Silver side marinated smoked. Let's get onto these flaming hot Cheetos then, man. The flaming Cheetos. Now I've tried these before. Yeah, that's the problem. We've got these in the UK ourselves, so. Yeah. So uh, I've tried these before. The only one thing that I'm not really keen about, yeah, is the fact that they're so fat. You're gonna get stuck in your teeth as well. Yeah, like, but they're always good for licking fingers when you've got to the bottom and it's all crumbs. Mm. That's the best bit of any pack. Mm. They're good, man. What are we saying out of 10? I wouldn't say 10 out of 10, but they're not even really that hot. <laughs> 8. Yeah, about an 8. I mean, they are typical munchy food. Quid. You know, things that go for a pound are always good, innit? Oh, that's why Poundland and shit like that survive for so long, because everybody loves the fact that things are a pound. But, uh,. It seems like the flaming hot ones are really popular here, but not so much the cheesy ones. Yeah, I mean, I picked these up from uh, the shop at the end of the road, one of the Polish shops, and when I showed you them, you said, oh, I've not seen them ones before. But these, I think, are more, more like the ones that they actually get over there. They're a lot more like Twigglets. I'm going to wrap these back up. Do you want to have full, bruv? No, man, I'm not. I'm going to wrap them back up, bruv, because I've... I'll try what I've not tried. I'm, I'm trying. trying. I'm, not, I'm, not eating. I'm not here for a meal. I'm here to try. So, next one. See these. So what are these called? Cheetos. These are crunchy cheese. Yeah, crunchy cheese flavor. These look more like the ones that you see in the American films. Like I always remember a scene from How High, which is a Red Man and Method Man, and they're standing in the principal's office, and one of them's munching out oh, Cheetos, yeah, 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 and, he drops and they are literally just like this. Like they're basically like the. Like, I'd say the British version would be knickknacks. Really, really insane. I'd say the British version would be knickknacks. <laughs> they smell cheesy. But they're well cheesy, man. Cheesier than what's it? Too cheesy? Oh, look. You're gonna. Oh. Oh. Too cheesy for Aaron. Now they get a zero from me, that's fucking disgusting. They get a 10 out of 10. <laughs> 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. <laughs> they're, because they're more crunchy. It's fucked up my breathing, bro. Because <laughs> <laughs> they're more crunchy, yeah, to these ones. And when they say they're cheesy on there, they are fucking really <laughs> cheesy. These fuckers, they say flaming hot and they're not really flaming or hot. Bro, they're vile. <laughs> you should see the look on his face. <laughs> Fucking picture. Right, we'll move on. So what, I'm, I'm skipping them. So we'll have to swap cameras and you'll have to get some footage of Aaron scoffing one of them. Let's try some of that birthday cake. Birthday cake. Hurry up, we've got a low battery. I've got hurry up, we've got a low battery. Oh. And I didn't bring the charger like a dickhead. Charger's here. Is it? Yeah. Alright, so we'll stop quickly we before we try to. these and then get a bit of charge in the camera. Yeah. We'll be back soon. So, so the next one is the old uh, birthday cake popped corn. Some of the butchers. Yeah. White chocolate drizzled birthday cake flavoured popcorn. Now, I do like popcorn and I don't really have a preference. I like salted, I like sugar. I like butter popcorn. I've never tried anything like this. Toffee popcorn is probably the closest thing I've. That's what I mean. I'm a toffee or sweet man. I'm not a big. 
Like, I don't like the salted stuff. But generally, yeah, generally speaking, I'm more savoury. Like, I'd, I'd, if someone offered me a bag of ready salted crisps or a bar of chocolate, I'd take the crisps over the chocolate any day. <coughs> but um, I am a fan of popcorn, and I'm looking forward to trying this. I mean, look how pretty they look in the bag. Look at that. Let me get one up. I can't see very well. Look at that. See if I can get a focus on it. No. Yeah, they've got all little uh, multicoloured. All the little, like, hundreds and thousands on there. I'm going to give that a go. Look, it's double there. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. Sure. Really nice. Where did you find these? Asda. Asda. It actually Pop tastes like birthday cake as well. Yeah, that actually tastes like cake. Really nice. Not too sweet. They <laughs> are really sweet. No, nah, I think that, I think... I think they're not too like because you know when you eat stuff and you get all your the side of your mouth and you, your mouth fills up with water and that because the taste. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's not quite hits you like that. It did for really me. nice. Too much for you. I will recommend they're that. Nice. They're just really sweet. To any to any popcorn lover, you want to watch a film with the missus or the or the fella or whatever, and you have popcorn. I would definitely pick up a couple bags of them yeah, because they are piff. Ten out of ten for the birthday cake popcorn. Most definitely, I may even have one more before I wrap it up. Yeah, that's great. Oh shit. But they do spray everywhere. So I'm going to try the uh, Hostess Snowballs. Because Sooth can't eat the uh, pork gelatin that's in it. The Twinkies are made by the same company. I know these are really popular in America. I heard about these from uh, Zombieland. Isn't it? Mm, on the search for Twinkies. Yeah, man. You think what's all the hype about? And I tried one in a pretty good. Well, I've never tried one of these before, so let's see what these are Well, we get snowballs in this country, but I've never seen one that size. Oh. Cooked on the bottom and that. Oh. Okay. It smells like a Christmas pudding. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, look at the inside of that. Okay. So it's like chocolate cake just coated in. That looks quite nice actually. Not like the traditional snowball that we'd get over here, is it? Because that would just be marshmallow coated in coconut, wouldn't it? Oh, you mean the um like the tea cake things. Tea cakes, yeah. yeah, very similar. I know tea cakes have biscuit on the bottom, but like you can get snowballs without the biscuit. Yeah, but that's nice for sure people but look They look out. like they're gonna be a lot nicer than than the ones that we get over here in all the shops. Yeah. And again, where did you find that? Asda. Asda again. It's got like a whole section. Oh, okay. Of American stuff. So again, you get actual specialist American stores and they're, they're fucking expensive, aren't they? Again, they're really sweet. I've not really got much of a sweet tongue myself. These are one of your favourites though, I know that fam. No, I like a Twinkie. Good old Twinkie. Not only it reminds me, you, it reminds you of zombie, it reminds me of fucking Sausage Party. <laughs> the Unperishables. <laughs> Film's got so many issues. <laughs> so I have a quick little look at the wrapper. Boom. Got a heart on there to let you know you're gonna die early and eating this shit. And again I love it when it says as well. Like what's it say? It's a derived from a genetically modified source. So these are literally GMO in a wrapper. Like clearly states it, like any of that in there, like that probably won't collect mould on it. Yep. Yep. Out of ten. November five. Are they better than the English ones? Better than tea cakes, no. No. Tea cakes piss all over them. Yeah. Knick knack piss all over them. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mark kiss chocolate <coughs> popcorn pisses all over them. <laughs> we ain't got no Monster Munch flaming hot pisses all over the that. The flavour, yeah, definitely. And we don't have an equivalent of the beef jerky so because far, it's whack. The Brits are winning. Um yeah, I'm really fucking sweet. I'll give them an eight, them a five. Boom, boom. Pa. Pa. So, here's the coup. Next thing is Pop Tarts. Now, I remember eating these when I was a kid. I never seen these ones. These ones look like Oreo, like similar to Oreo. The cookies, cookies and cream. cream. Um, the ones that were popular when I was growing up were like, they're like strawberry flavour. 
and things like that. There was chocolate ones. I think there was a strawberry flavoured box. There was, yeah, there was strawberry that flavoured ones. Nice the Massive was the very first one I ever see. When I, and again, it's not something, they were massive when I was a kid, like huge. And um, throughout the years, it sort of died down. And again, like it just literally just says there, quite openly, naturally and artificially flavoured. And that's right on the right on the front with big big letters, so you can imagine what it's, it's going to say. It's got the old American Olympics logo on the top as well. So um, what we're going to do is I'm going to bang these in the toaster because these have got to be toasted. And while we bang them in the toaster, we'll try something else and wait for them to pop. So over to the toaster. Over to the toaster. See, look at that. I love these things. I remember loving these like, like if my mum said I could have these How many is in the packet? There's four packs in a box and two in a packet. We'll just put one in, I'll try and buy it yours. Yeah? Oh, you want to put two in? I'm not bothered. I'm, I'm not bothered, I don't mind fucking... I might not eat it, or <laughs> I'll probably just have it's a right. bite. They are very sweet. Speaking I mean, of like, American food, I had a dirty KFC today, so <laughs> I'm full. But even then, like, to think, I know I've never been over there, but we know people that have, and they'll say like the takeaway over there, take over here to think like, like yeah some, I see a video of some Americans doing, trying the McDonald's yeah. the other day and they said the the chips don't taste nowhere near as dirty as theirs do yeah and fucking like that man v food and I was watching that around the missus the other day like the amount the portion size and things like that it's just like wow all right so we try a Hershey's you want to try Hershey's I know you're itching to try this one now <laughs> We've seen a load of videos and things, and again, like I've tried the cookies and cream. I've never tried this one, so it's basically the American version of dairy milk. Dairy milk, and I've not. I, I'm so we've got to try and compare the two now. And again, I'm not a big chocolate fan. Right, do you want to give me a square, bro? But it smells. It says that it's creamy milk chocolate, but when you smell it, it actually smells like. It smells like fucking dark chocolate. You know when you get like lint and it's like 90% chocolate? It's cocoa. It does taste like lint. Do you know what I mean? It tastes like the cheap chocolate. Like uh, as the zone or you know what I mean? Mm. That cheap chocolate. It's not very creamy at all. It's cheap, isn't it? Yeah, like, I don't even want to try the second bit to suck on it because normally I'd suck on chocolate but Rapper's worst nightmare is chocolate. Makes your mouth gungy and everything, especially when it tastes like that. What you reckon and compared to dairy comparing milk? Comparing it to dairy milk, and again, I don't eat a lot of chocolate. I have to be in the right mood for it. Comparing it to dairy milk, I would say it's not got fuck all on dairy milk. Yeah, you Americans these need to different. step up your game, bro. Yeah, I know these taste different. You try this and you'll, tell, you'll see the difference. This is obviously white, the white chocolate with cookies and cream in it. And um, I've tried this one before. Uh, you can get these in a lot of like supermarkets. That's Fucking the, made me jump around. That, that's the tart that's just popped. <laughs> Try these in a lot of supermarkets. You see, I watched the uh, It film the other day, mm. and you know when they put like scary, suspenseful music in horror films and shit. Yeah. I swear, at one point of it, it was a toaster popping up. Like, in like, it sounded like it a toaster. Yeah. Made jump. <laughs> yeah. Like, you see here, this one's not because it's got a lot it's more in it. Cookies it's not, in there. Yeah, it's not going to taste quite as. Probably as bad as what it's the other one did. Focusing on it, which is a bit shite. Do you want to try a block of that? Yeah, I'll have a bash. 